So I got this question in my inbox about the carousel, about putting more pictures than what's in the template. So I found a way we can do that. So let's go over to Canva and make a carousel with more pictures in it. Let's go. So for this, I'm gonna start off with uh, the template that you got from the drop carousel video. Um, we're gonna go and I'm gonna delete all that stuff out. Maybe I'll change the background color a little bit out of this red. I don't know why I chose red to send that to y'all, but ew, that's just a little too. Oh yeah, that looks a little bit better. All right, so what I'm gonna do here is I am going to make a small carousel just for speed. Um, I'm gonna take out these and I'm gonna make a five carousel because we wanna know, we wanna add more photos than what a carousel can hold. So the smaller it is, the more we, you know, the more you have to add a different way. So what I'm gonna do real quick is I am gonna build a carousel. And then if you've already, you know how to build your carousel, you can go ahead and skip over this part, but I'm gonna build a carousel for people who have never seen it before, just in case they stumble across this video. So what I'm gonna do is build it, put it real fast for you guys, and then I'll be right back. So now we have our carousel built out, but it's full. We don't have any more spaces for any more puppies, right? So we're gonna go to our last page. So we wanna add this little corgi over here. So we're gonna put him up top to be the next one to drop down, right? So we're gonna duplicate our page after we put him up there. And then what we're gonna do is I'm gonna go in here and I am going to duplicate this frame and I am gonna move it down just a smidge so I have enough of this frame right here so I can use this frame too. So now what I want to do is I want to take the transparency down to zero on this one. And then I'm going to take my, my little Pomeranian and I'm going to put it in that frame. And if you look and turn the transparency up, he's in there. You just can't see him. So now I'm going to move everybody around in their spots. So let's go. We're going to put the Corgi in the big spot. And then who was there? Oh, sleepy dog, sleepy dog, fuzzy dog, uh, the black lab, the runner, and the Pomeranian is already in there. And then you'll have, uh, let's go with the uh, sunglasses dog. So, and we'll do one more, duplicate the page. So, and now we want to take and move them over. So I will do him over, sleepy dog, fuzzy dog, lab. This one goes into the sleeper one. Let's see, is he in there? Yep, he's in there. And then we want to move sunglasses down to the main one. And I don't know if you wanted to do another one. You just put another dog up there. So let's look at it and see what we got going on now. So we're going to look at the end of it. And you see, so now you're dropping. So what goes here, they disappear. And you can keep on adding and adding. And you can add as many as you want that way. And you can do it on the bigger one. Of course, you're going to keep moving more pictures, but I just wanted to show you what you can do. And if you have any more questions or anything, please leave them in the comments. If you're on my Facebook, come and stop by. You know, I'm always there to help. I love you guys. Um, I'm always here. If I can answer a question, I'm here for you. Thanks for stopping by. I hope I answered your questions and you can make beautiful carousels. I'll see you on the next one with much love, Michelle. Until next time, bye.